this is a really quick tutorial. Um, sometimes when you have really bright light, such as in this example here where it's got some pretty intensity of light here, and actually a little bit of the person is in the photo, and you've got this kind of weird light here, sometimes it's only better to darken the image. Okay, so I'm going to duplicate this background, call it my working image. Say OK. And I'm going to come over here to Image Adjustment Levels and I'm going to actually darken this image to about. I want to see some detail in the cup, so I don't want to make it too dark, so probably to right about there. Say OK, so that's about uh, 44. Went from 0 to like 44 on my level diagram right over here. Click OK. Now I'm going to go in with my cloning stamping tool. And I'm going to remove this completely out. Put my opacity on 100% so I can completely get rid of this. I'm cloning it with black right now. Okay. I'm going to crop in a little closer with my navigator going right down here. Making sure I've gotten rid of all that and also any little white specks. I'm going to clone this part. Now the person that was in the background is completely gone. I don't see them. I'm going to go through and make sure I don't have any little specks of dust. Go to the top here and check it out. Okay. Come down. I'm going to go control minus, and we've got some really cool lights in here. Um, I've got a little bit of a red spot that I want to get rid of. Right here. And um, there's some dirt in the glass, but I'm just going to leave that there because it actually kind of looks cool. Maybe I'll get rid of this a little bit though. a little bit of that on and maybe a little more dust there I'll get rid of. I'm going with a little bit of a smaller brush. Do a few areas. Just clean up a few areas. Where there's some dust. Back. But in general I want to keep most of it because it's on the glass and Try to clean up that much dust would really just ruin the image. There's too much stuff to try to clean up. So, and if you don't like what you do, undo it. Use your history and undo what you did if you don't like the way it looks. Okay, so that looks pretty good. I'm going to go Control minus. I don't even need to add a vignette to this because it is so dark already. And we've got some great coming out of this glass. I'm going to come over here to Image Adjustment. I'm going to go to Hue Saturation. And I'm going to saturate the color just a little bit and maybe adjust the color a little bit down. I can start picking up more of some red. And these streaks. Looks pretty cool. Maybe like a little bit darker. But not so dark where it starts to get grayed out. Say OK. And my image is done.